All right, peeps. One of the most common things that we see with exercise, CrossFit, hard exercise works, your own fitness programming is RDLs and hinging through your hips. And the best way that I see being taught with the most optimal movement mechanics as possible is using a PVC pipe or a dowel and putting it behind your back like this. Keep three points of contact the whole time. Behind your head, behind your shoulder blades, and on your butt. And maintain those three points of contact the whole time as you hinge like this. And I'm kind of bowing forward and coming back up again. That's the hinge. Without letting the pipe come off your butt like this. When I do that, it's because I'm rounding my back and I'm not keeping my back locked in extension and hinging at my waist. And that's not the best mechanics. And this exposes that with the pipe, which is a great thing. And you should definitely feel that in your hamstrings. RDL is actually a hamstring strengthening exercise. Lengthening your hamstrings under tension, which is called an eccentric strength activation exercise. The way to progress that, when you feel like, hey, I got the mechanics down, progress with a kettlebell or a barbell. Same movement we just did with the PVC pipe. Pretend as if you had the pipe behind your head, your shoulder blades in your butt, and keep those three points of contact as you're kind of bowing and hinging forward with the barbell like this. Again, this is a hamstring lengthening exercise called an eccentric strength component. So as you progress like that, you should definitely feel it in your hamstrings. If you're doing it right, you're definitely gonna feel that the next day. So if you have any questions, hit me up.